My name is Anastasia and I'm your teacher in Edunguru. Welcome on French class. Today we discuss greetings. Why is it so important? In French culture it's absolutely normal and polite to greet all the people like postman, your neighbor in the lift or maybe shop assistant. There are two kinds of situations that you can face formal and informal. Exactly, when you are speaking to your teacher, professor, unknown person, person who is elder or maybe your boss, it is formal situation. Your friends, family members, maybe the people of the same age or younger, all these are informal situations. The most usual greeting is bonjour. Try to pronounce it correctly. The sound should go through your nose. Bonjour. If you need to greet somebody in the evening, you just take Bonne nuit. I pay attention, there is no nasal sound. Bonne nuit. All these greetings are formal. If you want to greet somebody in a formal way, you will use the form salut. I would like to pay your attention that T at the end is not pronounced. Salut. Now, don't forget, if you use formal way, you should use sir or madam. Bonjour, monsieur. Bonjour, madame. Previously, there was a form mademoiselle, that is the same that miss, but nowadays it's not so much used. So you can use bonjour, monsieur, to greet male person. Bonjour, madame, to greet lady. After all, you would like to ask, how are you? Formal way, comment allez-vous? Comment? Allez-vous? Let's to pronounce it like one phrase. Comment allez-vous? Informal way, ça va? If you would like to answer in positive way, you should say ça va bien, très bien, ça marche, merci. If it is so-so, you should say comme si, comme ça. If it's not so good, you can say ça ne veut pas. Now I'm going to greet you in different manners and you should answer me at the same manner. Don't forget about formal and informal style. I meet you after dentist and I ask you, Ajay, ça va? I think you will say, comme si, comme ça. If you meet your favorite actor, what greeting will you choose? Of course, bonjour, monsieur, to show your respect and your admiration. Neha. Salut! Ça va? If we are friends, you can say ça va. If I'm your teacher, you should answer bonjour, madame. Do you feel the difference? Okay, now let's discuss how to say bye-bye, goodbye. The most natural is au revoir. Au revoir. If you want to say see you soon, à bientôt. À bientôt. As usual, I pay your attention, we don't pronounce T at the end. A bientôt. So, if you want to say goodbye in an informal way, you can say au revoir. Au revoir. Compare au revoir for formal and au revoir for informal. You can say bisou, bisou. It means kiss, kiss. Of course, you can use it only for nearest and dearest. You can say je t'embrasse, that means I hug you. So let's summarize. Today you studied the greetings. Such formal greetings as bonjour, bon matin, bonne nuit, such informal greeting as salut. If you would like to ask how are you, you should use comment allez-vous. You know that for formal way to ask how are you, you should take comment allez-vous. For informal way, you can just ask, ça va? The best answers, ça va bien, très bien, merci, ça marche. To watch the next episode, 
Kindly choose the correct answer. Question 1. Let's imagine French President Emmanuel Macron meets Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Choose the correct greeting for this situation. The options. Salut. Ça marche. Bonjour. Once again. Salut. Ça marche. Bonjour. Question 2. How will you ask your neighbor, how are you? Options. Comment allez-vous? Ça va? Ça va bien? Once again. Comment allez-vous? Ça va? Ça va bien? Question 3. What option will you choose to say goodbye to your granny, whom you visit very rarely? Options. Au revoir. Salut. À bientôt. Once again. Au revoir. Salut. À bientôt. So, today we discuss such important topic as greetings. Why is it important to greet people? How can you do this depending on the situation, formal or informal? I hope the lesson was very useful for you. I wish you good luck and thank you.